Racism is fine, but you can't say. That's it. Yeah, that's yeah. it. You can't say. I think the only words you can't say are actually. Yeah, oh, I saw really? the post. And keep damn to a minimum in like. What about? Shit to a mm. I think that's a compound, but it still uses. Com- so yeah. probably not. <laughs> That's See what you tried it's going out of my set. Yeah, uh, <laughs> dang it. They like the hockey points. Yeah. yeah, but I mean it's not a bad. My you just yeah. And and if you do, the, this guy was mimicking jerking off last time I was there, uh, huh. and in a at, church at, basement. At the, yeah, at the, <laughs> that's a joke gym. And Drew was visibly like upset, upset about that. Yeah. But also he didn't do anything about it. Yeah. <laughs> right. Yeah. He said God will handle this. Yeah. You know? Yeah. yeah. Truly. Like, yeah. The guy was insane. He was okay. this, he was this black guy who I guess he's from LA. And, and his black it doesn't have anything to do with it. Sorry, I, I guess he's from LA. <laughs> <laughs> I Joe will laugh every time you say that. I got a picture. <laughs> you know, it is important detail. Let's paint a picture. Yeah. Which one's my camera? Which one? You can never <laughs> look at them all. Which yeah. one's? It's okay. He's not right. It's you can look at this one. It's fine. It's fine. But he was like moving around, and I was sitting in the front row, and he almost kicked me in the face like three times. And I was like, dude, you gotta just. Stand still up there. Yeah. Stop oh. fucking moving. Yeah, yeah you got to dial that down. You got to yeah. dial that back. Yeah, dude. yeah. That would have been bad at the Clearly, didn't night. really have many good words to say if you're <laughs> kicking around you're like moving. that. Yeah. yeah, that's just calm down, brother. Yeah. Brandon, he had, to, he had to rip the mic away from some guy on Tuesday. That was funny. He was like one of the last guys to go up really? at um, Woodridge Pub. Yeah, yeah. Oh, it was it, it was it was just like it was like his first time ever doing stand up, and okay. he like didn't understand what a light he was. He was tumbled. He was yeah. like, yeah, all right, yeah. this yeah. is yeah. it. Yeah. 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 Guys, yeah, we're back was, on the P Boys. Right. Hell yeah, dude. Yeah. What a lovely interlude. Yeah, Let's that was go. good. <laughs> that was good. Opening. Uh, Gabe's back. Yep. Jacob, yep. back, returning guest. Yeah. You have a new podcast. Yeah, it's on the Inner Wizard YouTube channel. Uh, name pending. He's really hesitant about giving it a proper name. Mm. That's cool. Name so, pending. Yeah. Check just out. call it that. Yeah. Name pending. There you go. Thank name you, Gabe. Pending. Yeah. Well, now we got to give Gabe like 3%. Yeah. Yeah. Is Grand Wizard taken? Grand Wizard? <laughs> I think it's taken, but by something else. Oh. Yeah. 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 And guys, this is... First time guest on the P Boys, but a returning guest in the Paradiso verse, yes. the greater Paradiso yeah. system. It's Andy McFarland. Hell and yeah. yeah! Woo! Thank you, yeah. thank you, thank you. Yeah. dude. This is a blast. Thank it's you. Been a while. Your, your your agent was taking forever to get back to me on booking you on the show. Well, yeah. I mean, <laughs> he's very adamant about getting all the sex traffic out of the building sure. before I. Yeah, for you, right? Podcast. Yeah, so you guys did a good job. I yeah. gotta say, you guys sure. did a good very job. Clean, very clean, very clean. We kind of stuffed everything in the closet in there, you know. How, yeah, there's how almost no cum. Yeah. There's yeah. almost almost doesn't smell like subway. <laughs> yeah. or, uh, smell like subway. Yeah. <laughs> jokes on you! I'm jerking off right now. Yeah. Uh, well, that's the thing as long about it's under the table. Yeah. Yeah. You can do whatever Jesus you want. Can't see that as long as it's under the table. <laughs> yeah, you know. It's good. Just keep it under the table. Exactly. Yep. There it's you go. Table talk. I would like to apologize. Last Shit, time dude. I was on this podcast, I was way too close to the mic the entire time. So really? Just, uh, I got yeah, yeah, okay. back it up a little bit. Comments about that. Really? Yeah, really? Like, no, yeah. No, no. God yeah, damn it, Gabe. Totally yeah. Didn't like it. I didn't like how close I was. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. So, what's new with you, Andy? You uh, you had a show last night. I did. I had a show last night. You uh, might have to sit a bit closer. Oh, I might have to be closer. Yeah. All right. How's this? You can move a bit closer. That's cool. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah. All right. No, I did. I had a show last night. Uh, my normal mic got canceled on Wednesdays yep. at the Roadhouse, which I do every other Wednesday. Shout out Roadhouse. Um, got canceled due to a power outage. So a friend of mine named Jeremy Hansen called and was like... Friend of the show. He owns an art gallery uh-huh. in Wyandotte. Hell yeah. A little sketchy. Is, that's a little weird. Yeah. Like, I don't know. <laughs> Strange. It's just weird. You know, yeah. To be fair, if you've seen Jeremy, you'd think like this guy definitely owns an art gallery. Mm-hmm. If he there did. was anybody who yeah. owned an art gallery, yeah. it would be Jeremy. Yeah. For sure. God, he's so he's so fun. He's so cool. He's, <laughs> he's like, last, dude. Yeah, dude. He's I wild. Jeremy. He's a wild man. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah, we did we just did a pop up mic there yeah. last night and uh we had, I don't know, maybe 15, 10, 15 comics show up. Yeah. It was just comics. Yeah. And we, you know, we just dicked around for like three hours. And just... I had cool hot sex with my girlfriend last night, so I couldn't make it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh. Stupid. My hands are very sweaty. <laughs> Could have been doing comedy, yeah. dude. What yeah. Is... <laughs> yeah, this dude put sex over comedy? Yeah. Oh, Come on, dude. I thought, thought you were a pro, man. <laughs> yeah. Was there like some cool art on the walls, like an exhibition going there on was there? So much cool art. There was a lot. There was a ton. There was a ton of cool art in there. Mm-hmm. And it was funny because I was up there and I was 
being dumb and just goofing around. And I was like, oh, this fucking painting's pretty cool, you know? And I'm like touching it. Yeah. And then Jeremy's like, could you not? You know, he's very Canadian. He's like, hey, hey, hey. hey. Can you not touch that, like, please? What? He's like, hey, hey. And then he pointed, it was like $6,000. I'm like, ooh, Shit. yeah, my bad. This painting's going for $6,000. That was one of the cheaper ones, actually. Oh, Jeez, wow. Yeah. Yeah. wow. No, this one, this was, it's like a serious gallery. Yeah. It's, yeah, Some no, it's, expensive it's, it's yeah. Deal. Damn. Shout yeah. out to you, Jeremy, with the big bucks. Hell yeah, dude. Um, Shout out to River's Edge Art Gallery. River's Why Edge Art Gallery. Okay. Check Why, it out. Check it out, people. That's a, that's a movie, isn't it, with like Keanu Reeves, River's Edge? River's Edge, probably. Seller. I think that was yeah. his brother. Oh, Fe- well, Phoenix. Phil. <laughs> <laughs> wait, 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 wait. wait. <laughs> Are we talking about River Phoenix? Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I think River Phoenix might be in the movie as well. But no, it's about like a, some high school kids, and like one of them is like a weird guy in their group, and he like kills one of the girls in the oh, group, no. and they uh, embark on a journey. Yeah. I went down a weird River Phoenix rabbit hole the other night, and I was like, they should make a movie about that. About River Phoenix. About River oh, Phoenix. Yeah. yeah. It was. Uh, it's really interesting. They like, were like, I'm sure people are fighting for the rights to be able yeah, to do that, yeah. like strip it from his yeah. family. Yeah. Joking yeah. is he's he's keeping he's he's holding them. Holding the fort, choking. Yeah, yeah. He doesn't yeah. want that. Yeah. Probably not. I mean, he was there when his when he died. It was. Oh, what, really? I think that was, it was like Halloween night. They were mm-hmm. all like, it was like Keanu Reeves. It was like all big famous actors, and like right. I guess he like OD'd like out front in the fucking where I forget what club they were at in okay. L.A. Yeah. But it was interesting. It was crazy. Yeah. yeah. Well, at least he did yeah, in the public. To Keanu Reeves, aren't you? I think, <laughs> like in like like three degrees away. Yeah. Okay. I think so. Hell yeah. yeah. That makes sense. Mm-hmm. I am related to Morgan Freeman. My oh, nice. grand, you know, my granny has pictures like of him like coming to like family reunions. And really? Stuff. So yeah. There's, there's I've seen them with my eyeballs. Yeah. So oh, shit, there's dude. definitely I've never yeah. never met him myself. Yeah. We'll Name never. Drop alert. Yeah. yeah, I think you're too old for him now. Yeah. <laughs> Still okay. very slick. Though. I could be. <laughs> Does he narrate at the family reunion? Like, <laughs> yeah. yeah. We're having Hello. a great time here in yeah, Mansfield, yeah. Ohio. <laughs> I used to film Shawshank over at um, that reformatory over there. That might have been why he was in the photos, too, because he would have filmed that movie. In, Maybe, yeah. Because that's like where my dad's from. By. He's from that place. Really? Oh, really? Yeah, yeah. 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 I didn't think much of the man first yeah. time I seen him. He was a tall drink of water with a silver spoon up his ass. <laughs> Maybe he based his character on Now You See Me often. Uh, I don't know that movie yeah. good enough to oh, keep going. Now You See Me. You know they're making a third one. God, what? And how? How? Are... They're literally just superheroes right. at this point. Right. Like, the, it's... it's not actual. Like, it's not like because oh. like the second one was like the first one was like kind of plausible. Some of the tricks that they did, but yeah. then the second movie was just like this is impossible. Yeah. This would you could never do this in real life. Yeah. What do you hear? Kind of took that evolution yeah. that those split movies like took yeah. under. Like it was just about a psycho. Now they're like superheroes. Yeah. Or whatever. Well, no, yeah. because I mean, the split movie was a sequel. It was an unofficial sequel to okay. Unbreakable. Okay. Uh, which was a 90s Shyamalan movie. Oh, really? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh, With I didn't know that. Where he gets in a train crash and then he finds out he's Unbreakable. Oh, wow. Yeah. Yep. Okay. Was the train crash? Hence the name. Yeah. 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 Uh, which I see what they did there. We got that. Unbreakable. Got, yeah. It's tricky. Yeah. 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 That's yeah. what good writing does, though. Yeah, you know? that's Shyamalan. He, you know, he has a thing or two about writing. Yes, he's done a couple. He's yeah. done a couple things. Did you guys see his new movie, Trap? Uh-uh. Trap was about it. It's like a, it's like a pop star concert, like a Taylor Swift. Oh, concert. I heard about the concert. And there's though. like a dad and his daughter, but the dad is a serial killer, and so the whole concert was like a ruse to get him into the concert so that they can like. The police can capture him. I heard it's oh, dog wow. shit though. Yeah, like I heard the, it was the, the idea seems yeah. cool, but I heard it, it was Execution. terrible. Yeah. yeah, that's how these movies seem to be. They're yeah, either, they're either like bangers or it's like yeah. oh, so bad. I saw I Signs was great. Signs, I love Signs. Signs, Signs yeah. is I saw awesome. that recently yeah. for the first time. It's a great. Movie. I like The Village too. Yeah. Everybody hated on The Village. Yeah, I was gonna I say that's the one that I hear the most shit about. I haven't seen it, but I heard that one. I thought it was cool. I thought that one was cool. Seen the happening where that guy like gets run over by the lawnmower. That's all. That's all I remember. Uh, Mark Wahlberg. Mark Wahlberg, Mark Wahlberg right? Okay. Hey, His greatest. The plants. They're, they're trying to kill us. <laughs> hey guys. Hey guys. I'm not trouble. Watch out for those plants over there. You do. How's your mother? Hey. How's your? Good is that the one? Oh, is know. that the movie where he was like chasing black people with like sticks or something, or like throwing rocks no, at them? No. Oh no, that was uh, that was Roots. Yeah. Oh, those Roots. Okay, <laughs> were they Vietnamese or were they Korean? 
<laughs> I think it was Vietnamese. They were they were Vietnamese. Yeah, they were. It wasn't black people. It was Vietnamese. What movie yeah, is yeah. this? It, no, wasn't, it happened in, in real life. life. No, oh. it wasn't. It wasn't a movie. Oh. Yeah, when he was younger, I guess something happened to. He like, like blinded an old Vietnamese. Man oh, for yeah, yeah, Mark Wahlberg. He doesn't like Asian people. That's right. Yeah, that's right. Oh, I yeah. forgot. My bad. Yeah. Yeah. Very anti. Asian. I, away. I knew that, but I yeah. Yeah, I'm glad it came to fruition <laughs> with us. Right, you'd be safe. Yeah, I'm safe around everybody. I think. Yeah, just about. I can just blend in like a lizard. Yeah. yeah. Chameleon. Yeah, exactly. What'd you say? Chameleon. Hey, that was, oh, yeah. yeah. That's a good, what's his name? Lizards now? Gecko. Yeah. Gecko. Uh, Gecko. Gecko. Uh, right. Same. Whatever. Uh, <laughs> more like Gecko. Oh. Right. Gecko. Uh, Me. Which one's my camera? <laughs> <laughs> They're all real. Yeah. Gabe, yeah. yeah. what's new with you? Um... I was late again yeah. to the show. Dude, you're consistently yeah, I am late. consistently late. We had a celebrity <laughs> guest in here a few weeks ago. And I was late. Hey, wait, it was well, like, you don't have a celebrity guest. Hey, you know what? It's, it's true. You guys are celebs. You guys are yeah. celebs. Yeah. <laughs> we had a minor celeb yeah. uh, in the studio. Yeah, and I was late. And he was so pissed about it. And he, yeah. he li- I think he liked me the most, honestly. He did like you the most. Yeah. He, he, yeah. He gave goosebumps. <laughs> I was like, Dude. <laughs> Talking about how I talked to God or whatever, he's like, "Holy yeah. shit, dude, that was crazy!" Yeah. Whoa, like, all right, yeah, blew his mind. <laughs> Wait, who was the celebrity? Uh, was Paul Leah. Leah. Oh, Paul Leah. Oh yeah. no shit, yeah. really? Yeah. yeah, dude, I know that guy. I met yeah. him a couple times. Yeah, he's a nice guy. He's, he's a nice. Guy. He's, he's nice. really, really podcast. religious. He's very militant in his. Uh, what is it? Palestinianism yeah. no, or uh, Syrian. Syrianism? Syrianism. Yes. Oh, gotcha. Yeah. I'm gonna start a goddamn war. <laughs> yeah, dude. Wow, really? I mean, I've I've seen that episode. I've seen that clip of you reacting. It's my favorite clip of you because <laughs> you're just unshaken <laughs> by him. Like he's just like, what do you mean? You didn't? Were you not listening just then? You're like, no, <laughs> yeah, yeah, I was. I was. I know you were. You I was not listening, <laughs> dude. I was so uncomfortable was, during that part when Joseph was like, "Yeah, I just don't care," and he was like, <laughs> "It like <laughs> broke his brain." You don't care about your community, bro, <laughs> dude. Yeah, no, it's. It is uh, no. what it is. You yeah, know? that guy was intense energy for sure. Yeah. I was like, "Wow, yeah. I am." Wow, yeah. I like I made only, a good I, podcast. Yeah, I, that's cool. I'm all, I only met him like in passing, it, yeah. And, yeah. Yeah. but I could see that, like how he, I could see him going. I mean, he's merely a tool <laughs> yeah. of something. His eye, than dude, himself. he didn't blink. Yeah, he did <laughs> he not blink. <laughs> Unblinking. Yeah. yeah. I talked about like busting, like coming on curtains, and he was just like, "What?" He was like disgusted by it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he was, oh, man, what? I don't know. I was like, dude, it's called the people. It's like, yeah. what do you expect? This isn't a clean podcast. <laughs> he also didn't know it was called the people. I said, so. Yeah. <laughs> oh, really? He didn't he, know I, I think he had no idea what, what he was <laughs> getting yeah. himself into. I was like, dude, he why do you agree? Did you just like this? chloroform this guy and just like put him in this <laughs> yes. chair? It's yeah. like, all right. Like, we hit him with the, the men in black fucking, you know, yeah. neuralizer. Right. Yeah. yeah. <clears throat> Yeah, I've been trying to get more celebrity guests, but it's not working. <laughs> we, we you, uh, didn't you? You came to the the comedy castle and tried to get uh, what's his? What, what, oh, no, uh, I was just joking about. That. Oh, you didn't actually do no, that. Oh, Kevin that. Nealon. He tried to get. He was going to get oh, Kevin dude, Nealon. I, on yeah. the pod. I emailed really? Kevin Nealon's agent, but oh, I wasn't yeah. actually going to go to the comedy. Oh, castle and try to like talk to him. Oh, okay, dude. that would have been hilarious. I just came to see you. Oh, okay. All right. You mean Did Kevin? You email his. You emailed his agent. Yeah, okay. every time there's someone performing in town, really? I'm finding their agent's email and I'm emailing them, and they never respond. Yeah, <laughs> you well, do a lot of walking yeah. and like hiking, though, right? Yeah. Like daily. Yeah, so you could you could go on Kevin Nealon's podcast, podcast and do that yeah, hiking. Yeah. 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 That'd be yeah. awesome. Yeah. <laughs> be like Kevin, you should have me on. Yeah, right. I'm the host of the P Boys podcast. Yeah, yeah. I'm sure you've heard of it. Yeah. You know what I mean? Who hasn't? I, yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like yeah. he's great. Come on. Obviously, you've heard of it. Yeah, comedy. And yeah. Yeah. I think it'd be cool. I'm trying to get Ian Fidan to come on the podcast. Yeah, he's going to oh, be yeah. around. Yeah. He's going to be around. He's going to be in town. It'll be fun. For the yeah. Motor City Comedy Fest. Yeah. And he's bi, so it's perfect. He's bi, so yeah. you can fuck him and yeah. I can watch. Yes, yeah. exactly. Yeah. It'll be a good podcast. Exactly. Yeah. Dude, we and then I can it? dress trans and then he'll fuck <laughs> yeah. me. Yeah, well. yeah, right. You could be a lady right. boy or exactly. whatever. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Very cute. Yeah. I don't know if that's anti trans or. I don't know. It's very inclusive. Which one is it? I'm not. Those are like Thai lady. Because it's yeah, it's like a, it's like a. I prefer trap actually. (laughs) (laughs) That's my preferred uh, pronoun. Fair enough. Trap waifu. Yeah. You should get Bill Cosby on the pod. I I don't think he's he's up to nothing. I don't think he's doing much. Yeah, yeah. Nowadays, it would have been perfect if you got OJ on before he died, dude. Man, we missed. We missed our tune. We could finally hear his his side of things. Yep. Oh, God, OJ. 
I really wish OJ, man, he's going to miss so much shit. It's really sad he didn't get to see the election this yeah. year. Yeah. It's really. I would like to hear They took him away it. so soon. Wasn't yeah. he a big Trump guy? He would have been. I'm pretty yeah. sure. Okay. Yeah. Oh, 100%. He yeah. yeah. Trump's missing out on his biggest, his biggest ally. Yeah. OJ. It was interesting, like his thoughts. He would just like post TikToks every day, him on a golf like, course. Hey, just like, world. hey, hey, uh, or no, it was Twitter. He's like, hey, hey Twitter world yeah, or whatever. Exactly. Just, like, <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Yeah. yeah. <clears throat> that is great watching like yeah. all old celebrities like try to navigate ingratiate yeah. themselves yeah. Yeah. like hey this is social media yeah. I like yeah. relevancy yeah remember me I killed a guy yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I remember Anna and a girl I mean I didn't but if I did and a woman they made a book about me oh, then they changed the allegedly. title allegedly not they he made a book about Dude, himself I mean God. fucking crazy not real I mean, I mean well, yeah he's <laughs> I mean, he's just the fact that he was able to experience everything that you could experience as a human being. Yeah. Fame, like Football. taking life, creating life. Sure. I think it's White Tim Dillon women. that says he's probably like one of the most American people. Absolutely. Like, he's lived the most American life. Mm-hmm. I'm like, so true. Same yeah. with like Caitlyn Jenner as yeah, well. Yeah, I was going to yeah. say Caitlyn Jenner. Exactly. Caitlyn Jenner, yeah. 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 And Trump. Mm-hmm. And Trump. Sure. Man, I'm well, really falling off Trump lately. Like, he's really well, dropping yeah, the ball. Yeah, once the assassination yeah. happened. He's really was. dropping the ball. Yeah. Like, he needed to use, I mean, I don't know. Just the people that are running this campaign are just a bunch of fucking retards. He's got to pick dude. something and stick with it. He's got to yeah, pick, like, yeah. a Dude, get rid of JD. It's he's like, running out of time. Like, yeah. he's, it's really bad. And the yeah. Democrats, yeah. they're killing it, yeah. dude. They're, they're fucking they? killing it. Well. I mean, as well, far as what I'm seeing. I mean, what they're doing. I think the polls are closer than we think, for sure. I don't know. I mean, just what I'm seeing. I think they're doing the right things. They're using the shit out of TikTok. They're bringing Lil John in. They're like they brought Lil John in. They brought Lil John in. Did and you not see the D- the DNC and the RNC? Turned out like, Trump. Yeah. Hulk Hogan. Hulk Hogan. Yeah. Hulk Hogan. True. true. That's true. a good crew. Yeah. If I was going to be in a Predator movie, that would be my go-to crew. Yeah. Kid Rock, Hulk Hogan, 50 Cent. And Fuck Donald yeah. Trump. <laughs> and Donald Trump. I'm starting to think this Trump guy is not very honest. I think he's, <laughs> he's not, just... I, I think, uh, I think politicians... Yeah, almost politicians in general. It's almost like they're, they're not... Lying. They're not saying... It's like it's almost like See, we have but, the same problems you understand, problems Trump's not a normal politician. He's, oh, right. he's a business <laughs> man. Guys, right, right, guys right. he's a business he's man. A he runs business a business. Man. He's and a business man. America needs a man. CEO. You don't... <laughs> You don't get it. We need a, a monarch. We want it's already right. ran like a we, business. Yeah, yeah. we he really couldn't do it. He couldn't fix everything the first time yeah. because he had to tweet. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like that first four years. Well, that's why he doesn't have Twitter anymore. Yeah, he can really He's, focus yeah. up. Right. I do feel like I am going crazy because, like, my you, entire family is like you super, like, yes, Kamala, yes, and I'm like. Isn't it just going to be the same four years we just it, had? Like worse. they just lie. It's, it's not going like, to be worse you're, they're, because they're going to fall under a deeper delusion yeah. that they're already indulging. Just, because that's the thing about oh, Kamala Harris is that she's the epitome of not have having like Kamala. credentials. Kamala. I don't even understand. <laughs> she has the credentials, but they mean nothing because she is nothing essentially. She is like water in a vase. Yeah. But it's it, but it's amazing to see her work. Like she's amazing at it. Like her just yeah. willingness to just lie. It's it's truly really something face. to behold. It's it's amazing. Cliff Demarco told a joke last night yeah. at the at the room last night, and I'm gonna butcher it. Sorry, shout out Cliff Demarco, but I gotta say this because it's super funny and relevant. Yeah. He had a joke about um, Kamala Harris, and he's like, Kamala is the most whitewashed name they could have get. you know her name was Kamala you yeah. know it was Kamala <laughs> but, yeah. is it like a, it's an Indian name no he's like they changed it to Kamala that's so I, I honestly don't know what to believe with her I don't believe her I, I don't not a damn she's she's just, she's black. I don't laughs, believe any but her laugh is so nice yeah 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 <laughs> feels so genuine and not hollow yeah yeah, yeah right everything it really so... instills hope in me when yeah. I hear her laugh it's yeah. very hearty very right. filling very good. Yeah. yeah, I think we should just bring Biden back, give him to a weekend at Bernie's, <laughs> yeah. dude. For fuck the next yeah. Four years. Just prop him up. That was fun though. I liked watching him fall. I liked that. Was yeah, that was pretty funny watching <laughs> him fall off that bike. <laughs> All right, I'm a, the bike yeah. thing yeah. was kind of set up. Let's be yeah. honest. They he pushed had him. The, he had the they, he had like the lock in shoe. Yeah, thing. yeah that was normal. like he was doing the tour de France. Yeah. Like, Why'd know. they give him that? This man is <laughs> eighty like, years uh, old. What are yeah. you doing? He's oh really? You're strapping in yeah. for the long haul on this one, yeah. Biden? I don't yeah. think yeah. so. My fault, the bike. <laughs> Dangerous. Ah, <laughs> yeah. oh, jeez. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Uh, that was mean. That was mean. Yeah, he that was mean of us. Yeah. Mean of what? Bringing that up? No, 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 no. Oh. Um, like. <laughs> 
like propping him up as just like a oh. puppet, you know, oh, uh, yeah. president. Well, oh, you know who's gonna win the election? We're mean people here. <laughs> who's gonna win the election? Big Mike. Big Mike. Hey, Big Mike's let's go. Back. Well, she'll come back. I think they they have to ride out Kamala here, but then they'll get them in the next one. But if Trump yeah. wins, then they'll bring the Obamas in in the next like Big eight Mike. years. Yeah, yeah, it's time. Yeah, yeah, it's time. Andy and I had our pre-podcast conversation last Monday. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> So we knew what to talk about. We had the talking true. points. Yeah. Um, yeah. Mm. Have you got? Have you seen the bulge? The bulge? Yeah. What is that? Big Mike's bulge. bulge like recently? Oh no, I have not seen yeah. the bulge. It, okay. I did in, like recent I did photos a, or like an old documented photo little, of the bulge. I just see the one photo of her in a dress, and they okay. circle the bulge. Well, maybe the circle is like a. I saw a video of her like she was like jumping or something. <laughs> also, and it's it was like, like it's cartoonishly big. The yeah. bulge. And I'm like, well, she's black, so her yeah. cock has to be huge. That's a good point. Could, wait, but was she outside? Like, couldn't it have just been her dress billowing in the wind, you know? Like, why? I don't know. Something was billowing. It's a very no, funny no, no, no. <laughs> you know what I'm no. uh. That BBC was billowing in her britches. Yeah. Uh, yeah, she probably has a big dick. I don't know. She, I mean, that's for sure. So. I'm just glad yeah, she still has so. it and that's she didn't hot. like clip it like some right. fucking mutant. Yeah. yeah. Come on. Does keep Caitlin the cock on the hers? trans. I don't know. I hope so. <laughs> I think that's the worst bit is if you get rid of Unless it's like a weird like psychological thing like I need this thing gone. But you if you're doing like some weird like demigod thing where like I'm transcended and now I have dick and pussy yeah. and yeah. boobs, like that's different. Steve-O. Yeah. A lot of different trans Steve-O, philosophies. Yeah, sure. Steve-O's going full tits, Oh, man. yeah. I heard Dude, that. That guy should tits. die. Steve-O's Fuck him. Getting tits. <laughs> Fuck Steve-O. I'm so he's, sick of seeing that like dumbass. He's like Kanye's mom and die. Yeah. He's so surgery. insecure about everything. I hope he just actually turns into a full woman and gets fucked by men. Yeah. yeah. All right. Oh, by Johnny Knoxville. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Johnny Knoxville. Sure they, I'm well, sure they've already had That'd be a funny prank. That'd be a wild To rape Steve-O. I don't know. I mean, sure, I good guess. on him, like, committing to a That's not exactly what I thing. meant, but... Uh. Yeah. Good jacket. <laughs> they stick them all in prison, whoever gets raped. And he's just, but, he's, but it's not rape, because he's, like, laughing. You know how Steve-O, like, uncomfortably laughs when yeah. he gets, like, hurt? <laughs> yeah. Come he's, on, Johnny! Yeah. He's high on nitrous, obviously. Yeah. Like, right. Loosen his asshole as well. Uh, yeah. yeah, I can't listen to him talk anymore. He sucks. No. Yeah. He doesn't do... I mean, I saw... I was watching uh, Too Lazy to Try, and he was highlighting Adam Friedland and Steve-O's like, controversy yeah. and how like Adam was on there recently. And like he immediately had no control of his podcast. Like He's so susceptible to Adam... What he perceives as Adam Friedland's like, psychic ability yeah. mm. or just his... I mean, he's just smarter than him. He's just smarter than Steve-O, and he, he's, he's literally just fearful of that. And it's just, it's very sad. Yeah. Smarter than Steve-O is kind of a low bar. Yeah. Sure. yeah. <laughs> I mean, like, like, you know what I mean? He, he did deep fry his brain for years. He started a years. podcast called Fuck Steve-O. <laughs> smarter than Steve-O. Yeah. Yeah. Are you smarter than a Steve-O? <laughs> smarter than Steve-O. And then uh, just have first graders. Can we get Jeff Foxworthy on this podcast? Yeah, sure. Probably the funniest thing Steve ever did was the tattoo I think on his back. Have you ever seen the tattoo? Mm-hmm. Yeah. It's what about a giant the... tattoo? It's it's literally his whole back, mm-hmm. and it's just a, a self portrait of him, and he's like, <laughs> and it says, "You rule, dude, Stevo." Yeah, it's like pretty in funny. His signature. Yeah. yeah. Uh, uh, Alex, uh, narcissism. Yeah. I liked when they they he they strapped him inside of a port like a full porta potty and then like it was attached to bungee cords and they just oh, launched him. I think I've seen that. And just yeah. like shit was just going every oh god it's awful. Did he have the uh, the toy car shoved up his ass or was that another jackass? I don't know. Oh, no, was that, that Ryan was, Dunn? That was Ryan Dunn. Okay. Yeah. Rest Ryan Dunn had the yep. Yeah, rest in peace, Ryan Dunn. I can only I'm watch. Glad I'm glad he got his work yeah. out there before he died though. Yeah. Get the oh, whole car and the butt thing. Jackass. Can only watch yeah. it in parts because it gets so gross like all the asshole play and like the dick shit that they do like they uh-huh. smash these two guys dicks <laughs> together and like they play with ping- the plates yeah and with then the, play ping the, pong that was yeah uh, oh. oh my yeah i was never so a too, jackass it's too many kid. dicks no, for game i, didn't, yeah. too much I didn't have a motorbike when game i was think that wasn't possible <laughs> you think that wasn't possible but he was like i'm getting a weird boner i gotta <laughs> shut this off dude i'm getting horny <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Gabe is famously yeah. the gayest person from the podcast. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, I was a diversity hire. Right, you know, right. Sure, yeah. sure. You gotta, you gotta check the boxes. Yeah, yeah. Check the boxes. Yeah. 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 Uh, yeah. It's 
Take it. Puerto Rican. Yeah. So Jesus Christ. Yeah. yeah. If that Puerto Rican right. would have been here tonight, I'd be out the door. Wait, yeah. you let Puerto Ricans in the building? Yeah, dude. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. It was like All that this and that shit. Yeah. We had to let a Puerto Rican on the podcast. <laughs> and the fucking deal was. Yeah. I mean, yeah. you let that guy on here all the time. Like, what kind of? You're like a. You always got a bad person. attitude too. Yeah, he's yeah, bad. bad. I mean, to be yeah, honest, he really does puss. have like a fucking sour puss <laughs> attitude. Every every time he's on here, he's like, I don't fucking man. Yeah, yeah. Like, look, uh, love the you, thing, Kevin. Man. Yeah. Fucking. <laughs> San he walks out so much, so he much. He just leaves. The He's a drama queen. Yeah, yeah. 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 really. really yeah. Is. Oh, Kevo. Yeah. Kevo. I'm gonna miss him so much. Fuck. Yeah. Where is he getting deported? Yeah. yeah. Oh. Sent back to Mexico. Well, yeah. well, it serves him right. Yeah. Yeah. Trump 2024. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Get out of here. Uh. I am actually so scared of November. I don't. I don't know what's going to happen. I don't want either one of them to win. I. Dude, ah, you, we want Trump to win, but it's just like I don't even know if it's going to well, happen. Anymore. If Trump proved anything, it he proved this. It doesn't matter. Yeah. Yeah. It really, yeah. It really doesn't. <laughs> it really doesn't. It's going to be the You're same right. thing every yeah. time. They're, they all golf together. Yeah. Jane, you're spending too much time with your but liberal girlfriend. Like yeah, I am. <laughs> my bad. Prefer, right, yeah. Because <laughs> that, that is also a factor because it is going to red pill. I got to red pill the shit out of my girlfriend. Yeah. Level. More than anything else, really, like oh, you said. Uh, we got yeah. to start one of those OnlyFans podcasts. Where it's just like two guys yelling at like six OnlyFans girls. <laughs> yeah, those podcasts running. suck. And then you're not like, trying to fuck those girls, you <laughs> fucking losers. That's the funniest fucking thing because it's like, why did you set this up to begin with? Also, it doesn't make any sense because you're getting literal professors and then the dumbest women on the planet. To, it's not a fair fight here. Yeah, yeah. Like, what are They're we not doing? Comprehending what you're talking about? No. Right now. Like just let them fucking just let, suck let them dick. Be and, yeah. yeah, but you got to understand cares? that these women have fallen away from Christ. We have to tell them that they need <laughs> right, to go yeah. back into Shut Christ. Up. <laughs> you fucking <laughs> nerds! God. These whores won't fuck me, but I can what? tell them that they're whores. Oh, what is yeah. this Sunday? Yeah, <laughs> and then like those same dudes go on like these alpha male tours or mm -hmm. whatever, and it's yeah. just like. God, I hate it so much. Or I love those boot camps that you see where guys will pay like five thousand dollars to like go through Marine training yeah. from some guy that was never like, in the Marines. Yeah, yeah. have like some guy like a bucket of them. water dumped on you. <laughs> yeah. Like, like I saw a clip recently of like guys, or I think it was Chugging actual milk. Marine like training. They had goggles on, and a guy was like filling the goggles with like hoses, and they were like constantly getting waterboarded. It's like, you like you fucking like that? Why are you quitting? Why are you getting out of the exercise? Like, so oh, strange. <laughs> That, yeah, that's the answer. I think that's the answer. That's actually. the key. I think yeah. that's, just, what, I think that's what I need. Just yeah. fucking drone strike Hamas so we don't have to fucking deal with these Navy guys anymore. <laughs> nice. What's weird is that's what those guys jerk off to. So. Yeah. yeah. Hamas jerk off to And they're the ones who want to yeah. stop OnlyFans. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Stop OnlyFans. Start jerking dude. off to this dude <laughs> doing sit-ups. Yeah. I thought you were talking about jerking off to drone strike <laughs> me. footage. Specifically yeah. me. Specifically Gabe doing yeah. sit-ups. Yeah. Not that I know. Hamas would love this podcast. What? Definitely don't send you videos. Now that I've ever watched Gabe jerk off. Yeah. He's actually been helping ever. me with my skincare. I got a lot of uh, back knee, and he's been he's been helping yeah. me out. Yeah. 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 I could tell. Yeah. All the steroids. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <It's wrong. laughs> they are not I do have a strange amount of back knee. I don't know. It's just where it all went for some reason. You just got a sweaty back. Yeah. Sweaty did you ever, hands, did you ever do steroids? No. No, 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 no. no, no, no. You were all natural. He's natty. All natural. All natty, baby. Not like they would test you in high school anyways. I'm pretty sure there were some people... <laughs> Literally, I'm trying to do a bit about this, but when I did powerlifting in high school, it was I was so small. The only other person in my weight class was an actual midget, like a literal <laughs> little person. And you think I would have won, but I didn't. He beat me so bad. Well, because you got the, yeah. the, the midget strength. Yeah, dude, dude, he's got you, that. You, like, I, I guess I didn't realize like they have like the, the body of like an elementary of schooler and then yeah. like the strength of a fucking full grown yeah. man. It's crazy. Yeah. Oh. He's, yeah, he was a little boy bitten by a radioactive man. <laughs> so yeah, <that's> all. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so fucking Arnold funny. Schwarzenegger. They have like the like they're the entire upper body of Chris Benoit. Is yeah. the midget's entire body? Yeah. Shout out to that midget. He could have lifted more, but black? apparently, yes, he was black. And apparently, See, well, yeah, <laughs> that's another factor I mean, entirely. <laughs> I didn't stand to, a not chance. Not to mention this guy was black. Right. I didn't stand a chance. No. Yeah. But apparently, he could have lifted more, but his like. 
His muscles were stronger than his bones. Like, his bones would have broke if he lifted, like, more weight. Oh, my weight. God. Because they're like, little bird bones, yeah, right? Yeah, little yeah, that's bones. They just have bird bones? He's got little That's bird bones. I don't know. I read that on Paper the Paper skins and glass bones. <laughs> this one. <laughs> Probably this yeah. one. Oh, yeah. It's yeah. Evie. Yeah. We just have bird bones. Pull that up, Jamie. <laughs> <laughs> we need a producer, for real. We need Jamie. a Jamie, dude. Yeah, we, we do. need a Jamie. keeps bitching about it. Yeah, like, we need a producer. We need a producer to yeah. look these things up. And I'm like, dude. I'm running out of budget here. Come that, was on. Great, that was a great impression. Yeah. Man, you're running a fucking yeah, circus in here. I mean, we could just like get a like. It's more Mexican you could than bust out your I don't know how to do it. I'm going to do Mexican whatever, the whole time, and he's going to be critical of it. Who would so we have fine. to do it, though? Like, you want to know what I'm doing? Right? No, I can't spell. So I, yeah. I would be terrible at, and I'm very slow at typing. So right. I would. You're like a finger, <laughs> yeah, finger typer. Yeah. Also, you're yeah. a better on camera than off camera. Yeah. Yeah. 100%. Yeah. 100%. We need yeah. to hit Gabe's a twink. little star. <laughs> yeah. Gabe's a star twink. in the making. Yeah. On camera, no audio. I'm, yeah. <laughs> well, well, no. Gabe makes it big. I'm going to take credit for all of it. Hey, that. yeah. I mean, I, I literally I literally just show up and you do everything else. Yeah, it's exactly. it's great. Exactly. And I'm late. Yeah. And you're late. Yeah. yeah. It's good. It's fun. Yeah. So, midgets. Midgets. Oh, I was uh, at the drugstore I work at. There was a midget there that was working there a little bit. Oh, I fun. Think she a was little a little bit. Yeah, a little bit. She was trying to, I think, get out of that life mm. because I think she was selling uh, content. Oh. So she was trying not to do that for a little bit, but it didn't work out. She got yeah. sucked back in. Sucked right yeah. back Money in. Money was yeah. probably too yeah. Have you seen it? I've not <laughs> seen it. Okay. No. How would you know about I'm just, I'm making I'm speculating. We're we're just speculating. Oh, well. She's a she's a cute girl though. She's a yeah. cute little midge. Yeah. 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 It's, it's, it's pure speculation. Noticed, have you guys noticed like there's like a insurgence of hot like hot midget like hot? There is a there is like, there and on my Instagram feed all of a sudden they're like hey yeah. try this out white old white guy and yeah. I'm like I don't think there's a resurgence I think that you're just having a discovery yeah I think yeah. they're just maybe pumping just, more maybe into your algorithm maybe I just found a new kink yeah maybe, maybe. I think uh, I could really but I was like. There's a call. I'm like, damn. There's they're, a very. Wow. They're bound to in, in the city. Well, it's, it's good to see. You know what yeah. I'm saying? Like, My, I mean, midgets are hot. Don't want to see any ugly midgets you know? getting fucked. I want to see. Same thing with like that <laughs> Down syndrome. Victoria they're gonna get Secret fucked. They better be girl. hot. <laughs> you guys see the Down syndrome Victoria's Secret girl? Yeah. Uh, no, I did not. Yeah, that was a few years ago. I remember. Yeah. Yeah. She's still. I mean, imagine. I, I hope she's I still. I don't keep up with huh. that. They probably killed her. I didn't know they. Damn, that's a weird. Even that's a weird thing to do. Strange, yeah. yeah. That's a weird. Thing you know, to be honest, do. really not. It's like, damn, you that. have Down syndrome, but I still want to fuck you. I don't. Know. Yeah. It's, I, uh, how do I feel about yeah. this? Yeah, I don't think they can, right? Can Down, I, Down probably, can be sexy too. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it probably just depends on the level of competency of the person. Because yeah. they definitely vary, as we've seen on like those Do you have to get like a parent's permission get. slip or something? Yeah. Yeah. I want to fuck your daughter. There you go. <laughs> it's just signed in crayon. Yeah, all right. That's, <laughs> that's awful. Yeah, I mean, yeah. <laughs> so bad. <laughs> Damn. Uh, yeah. Man, so hot though. Yeah. So hot. After oh, we're done, I'll get you a whole so box hot. of crayons. Yeah. <laughs> so hot. Eat the whole thing. This Oof. is not a good podcast. Uh, where do we go wow. from this here? This is not a good dude, podcast, this guys. Anyways, this is free Trump, dude. This, way, this is a Patreon <laughs> episode. Your Trump shirt's got me fired up, dude. Let's yeah. go. <laughs> me and Gabe are ready to storm the Capitol right. again. Yeah. We're ready got, to go. I got my yeah. tickets booked. I was never there before. Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh. yeah. By the way, we have like two followers on Patreon. Guys, what are you doing? You gotta Are you put are you putting out an episode every week on Patreon no. as well? Oh no, not yet. <laughs> no. That on, would be gotta too much. Those numbers yeah. up, we gotta get those numbers up before Come we start on, putting we episodes on the numbers. Patreon. Yeah. If we get if we get a hundred Well if you start saying that there's a stockpile of more stuff to There is a stockpile there. of oh, a ton of shit on the Patreon. Okay. Yeah. But yeah. we have two one of them is Papa Sean. Who is one of the co-hosts of the podcast, <laughs> and the other one is Riley, who is the former co-host of the podcast. I see. He must have just forgotten to unsubscribe. So yeah, uh, Getting yeah. Five dollars for him. Five dollars a month, nice. baby. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And if we get a hundred uh, subscribers, I will show my asshole. Take out his penis oh. and his asshole. Oh, yeah. yeah. Is it well? Is it both or just one? So penis one at a asshole. time, one at a time. If we get another hundred, then gotcha. it'll, it can be both. So it's right. you know, your system. Yeah, yeah. like Scientology. Yeah. You got to do it yeah. artfully, though. Okay. Yeah. So you don't get any slips. <laughs> so guys, if you want to see Gabe's asshole, yeah. subscribe to the Patreon. Yeah. Yep. That's uh, OT yep. level. And then one. I'm gonna I'm gonna yeah. write a one and then a zero on both yeah. my butt cheeks, and then you spread it. That'd be cool. yeah. That's like the dumbest Patreon joke. Like everyone, like uh, for Patreon, I feel like every time we bring up Patreon, it has to turn like gay. Selling, yeah, like selling your right. body. Yeah, yeah. yeah. We're well, like it'd be Patreon. Am I right? Uh, am I right? Uh, yeah. That's awful. <laughs> yeah. 
Uh, um, I don't know where to go. Oh, gay uh, stuff. Patreon. Yeah. I wish I had a Patreon. Should start a Patreon. I cool. should start one. Yeah. And just be like, yeah. just give me five dollars. Just money. give me five. <laughs> yeah. Just give me five. Just <laughs> for nothing. Yeah. Just start a Patreon and do nothing. Yeah. Eventually, I'm gonna start a start a podcast. I can't do it here because I want to get fucked up on it and just go wild. Yeah. We'll do it once we get the new studio. Yeah. Once Kevin leaves and we have some space in the budget, we open the new studio. Oh, the new studio? Yeah, then we can do that. Okay, <laughs> yeah. perfect. Then you can do that there. <laughs> Hell yeah. yeah. Awesome. For with all the Patreon money that yeah. we're getting. Yeah. 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 Buy all the weed and alcohol. Sure. Yeah. Other yeah. drugs, whatever. Sure. Yeah. We can start pulling up. Yeah. That'd be nice. Yeah. Hell yeah. You guys have drank on the podcast before. I have. This room, though. Yeah, he's, yeah, he was a disappointed yeah. dad when I did oh, okay. it. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, it was too yeah. much. So right. if I'm going to do that, I should do it in my car before I come in. Sure. Yeah, okay. Do it on the way here. And it's then like something to do here. with this building, too. They would, yeah, would, he would get in trouble. Illegal, so. yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Extremely oh, right. That's what I'm saying. The yeah. new studio. Yeah, the Once new we get studio. the new studio where we own the building. and the, yeah. Is that in the works, the new studio? No. Got your hopes up. Damn it. Dang it. Yeah. Damn it. The new studio will be my basement, I guess. Yeah. 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 We're going to move the whole studio to Gabe's yeah. basement. Yeah. Gabe's parents' basement. <laughs> yeah. My parents' basement. <laughs> your parents' basement. My parents' basement. Yeah. Sure. To be fair, this podcast specific. started in my parents' basement. Oh, nice. So we're just moving. Yeah. yeah. Nice. Moving the. Nice. Yeah. Hell yeah. It's a lateral move. Yeah. Right. It's yeah. a lateral move. But <laughs> we're, we're hopeful. Yeah. Mm. Jacob, where is your podcast studio? Um, it's been at my friend's parents' basement. Ooh, and it's a running theme. Yeah, hell yeah. At his sister's uh, yeah. house. Yeah. Is it well. musty in the basement? It's a very nice basement. Okay, all right. Pretty no must. Nice home. Okay, oh, cool. Nice. Finished basement, projector, screen. Awesome. Look at that. Yeah, wow. it's like podcast. Finished basement, spaceship. Yeah. Yeah. So, Andy, if you start a podcast, you also have to start it in your parents' basement. Yeah, you gotta. You That's gotta, gonna be tricky. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> life cycle of podcasts. Yeah. <laughs> it has to start in your parents' basement. Yeah, no, we can do that. Yeah. Uh, my dad, my dad has a pretty nice basement. Okay. It's not okay. finished, yeah. and there's a bunch of like stuff, shit down there. Yeah. Rats. It adds to the yeah, aesthetic, rats, you know. A couple dead bodies. Nice guns, maybe. Um, no, no, those guns. are. At the ready next to the okay. door. Ah, yeah. well, <laughs> those are on hand. in the basement. What are we <laughs> talking about? The Irish mob. It's too much work. What's it's that? bad was on his knees. The Irish mob. No, no, he wasn't. He was. Uh, he's actually just. A, he's a truck driver. Oh, okay. And, uh, old. Good. He's old. He's. I mean, I'm old, so he's very old. Yeah. Um, he's being a, a truck bad. driver. That sounds like really? code for being in the Irish mob. That mm. sounds like code um, for being yeah. a homosexual. Hey, smoke <laughs> truck driver. Yeah, sure. <laughs> Is Irish mob like a thing here? Or no? I, yeah. Probably, probably uh, I know of. Okay, uh, yeah. Are mobs? It's probably, I mean, I are mobs in still things in this area? Yeah, I mean, if you Owens? look up, if you look up Chaldeans on Google, the first option is Chaldean mob. Uh, yeah, really? Okay. Yeah. What's the What's their name? I'm not gonna say the name. Oh, okay. Yeah. Does your... this guy still identifies as Chaldean? So sorry, he's got, sorry. He's got steak. Did your dad... uh, I'm actually in the Assyrian mob. So. Oh. The Assyrian mob, yes. Sure. Yeah. Assyrian sounds scarier than Chaldean, if I'm being real, because it says there's ass in the name. And it's seer- it's like right. serious, yeah. serious, yeah. serious, yeah. scary. Yeah. Because yeah. I heard that That's on the true. news a lot Chaldean at one point. Just sounds like it sounds like Christian. Ch. Yeah. yeah. It's yeah. nicer. Yeah, the Chaldeans are the nicer research. versions of the Assyrians. Yeah, they're the Christian versions, yeah. essentially. Yeah. Is what I gathered. That's all I gathered is that no, Chaldeans are just... Catholic, but it's just a different type of Catholic. Okay. Mm. Yeah, it's like the Irish versus Italian mob. Right? Okay. Yeah, Obviously, sure. the Italians sure. are more scary. Yeah. yeah. Chaldeans are more like... Yeah. It's more like a club, really. Yeah. Yeah. They just do a lot of hummus and sure. yeah. <laughs> after school stuff. So much hummus. <laughs> so, much. So, so many... Like, a lot of hummus and escalades. You so know? many... Yeah. So much chickpeas and tahini. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's the ingredients. Oh, okay. Man, I <laughs> yeah. Well, I mean, this is uh, the actually the metrics, like the the number the number one language that this podcast is watching is English, but the number two is Arabic. But it's like by point two percent or something like that. So. 0.2% more than English listeners? No, no, no. Like it's, it's 0.2% of listeners uh, are Arabic. Gotcha. Really? Or listen to it in Arabic. Well, it's All probably right. just well, those spikes nice. from when Chris was on. Yeah, I think, yeah. yeah. I think it was, yeah, just his, 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 Chris. his fans. Yeah, right. Is that free Palestine? I don't know. Yeah, whatever. Just say free Palestine. The right thing. The right thing. 
from the river. Uh, the right to oh my god, I'm so, I'm so scared right now. I mean, the right thing to say is that there's a genocide going on in Palestine, and we need to disavow Israel. Yes, I believe that. We That's need, not the stance of this podcast. We not, did not cuck out. <laughs> no, I've been working on this new bit. Where, like, there's all these like there's all these shows that they're doing fundraisers for Palestine. Oh my God, like every week there's like a new like Palestine fundraiser show. Yep. And it, raise money for my dad's they don't, leg. They don't do any for Israel, mm-hmm. but Jerry Seinfeld's still going on tour, so I guess that's you know Hell yeah, so dude. they do so they do for yeah. Israel. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> White guys for Palestine. White Gay guys for Kamala, I don't know. Is that Gays a thing? for Palestine is the funniest thing. Gays for Palestine is <laughs> Gays to throw off buildings in Palestine. <laughs> yeah. 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 That's my favorite segment of people. Gays. <laughs> gay Palestinians. Trans for Palestine. It's, it's, it's like, amazing how. Same with gay Ukrainians <laughs> yeah. as well. And everybody went in, everybody went crazy in two different directions. Yeah. Yeah. It seems like right. Mm-hmm. Like always the way. You know? I'm just trying to toe the line of yeah. like. Well, that's not we allowed, just, dude. Maybe. Yeah. I don't know who said this, but somebody was like, I Kanye is like always ahead of the curve or something like yeah. that. Yeah, that's true. What was that? I'm sorry. Kanye is always ahead of the curve, you know? Yeah, he's, Kanye's he's like on a Jews wizard. before it was cool. He's right. a wizard. You know? As far as he's concerned, he's a literal wizard in his own mind. And I, I, I get He's a wizard. That. He's a wigger? He creates. Yeah, he's a, a, wizard. a wigger wizard. <laughs> he's basically a wigger at this point. Uh, there's too much 5G going on around. Well, yeah, I mean, they got to tone Kanye down the 5G. That's what it is, actually. Brain. Yeah. If Kanye didn't achieve the level of fame, he would have had like a Hitler level archetype because he would have got like not into art school. He could have done the. That's thing. a good point. Yeah. yeah. He would have never that, thought about that. Yeah. Kanye is the antithesis of Hitler. Yeah. <laughs> Hitler. I think we Hitler. split that part, that Higgs boson particle. Remember when we, when the like scientists split yeah. the Higgs boson particle mm-hmm. in uh-huh. 2015, and like the hydrogen collided, and so. we just got we we got shot off in an alternate and timeline. Alternate. Yeah, that's and that's alternate. what yeah. happened. Yeah. Everybody lives in their own timeline, though, it, and it really is just determined by what channels of information you're taking, and that's what really makes like reality individualistic for everybody. Yeah. So when you overwhelm yourself with a bunch of caca and bullshit, I mean. Just like There's a lot of big words you use there. That I got lost. <laughs> Sorry, no, we're, I'm trying to <laughs> escalate. <laughs> our, I'm raising our cock. Lost in caca. That's why, Jacob. I gotta have an episode of you and Drake on the podcast together because you guys were just conspiracy out. I, I would like to come on. Was Drake and Huddy was on there? Not Huddy. Dra- uh, yeah, Yo Cloudy. Yo Cloudy. Yeah. Me. Yeah. Whatever. You guys were just conspiracy out. That'd be a great yeah. episode. Yeah. Yeah. I'd probably just be make fun of Cloudy. I don't know. Oh, yo, Cloudy? Yeah, he's a funny he's, boy. Yeah, he's kind of funny. Yeah. Like to look at and like when he talks <laughs> about stuff. Yeah. Hell yeah. I don't want to hate on Yo Cloudy because he's a friend of the show, but he is a ridiculous character. <laughs> yeah, he's a fun character. Yeah. That's not a character. I, like, that's just him. But like I'm saying, like, he as a character is a ridiculous boy. Mm-hmm. Indeed. I agree. Yeah. I Absolutely. Agree. I don't know who you. He was. Was that? Was that one where I was supposed to be on it, but I didn't. Probably. Yeah. Okay. I You're was supposed looking. to be on everyone. Yeah. Like, oh, yeah, yeah. True. Yeah. True. <laughs> Fuck. Fuck. You had one job, Gabe. Yeah. You had one job. Co-host we have a, the podcast. A very dramatic episode. I didn't invite you to this one, but we oh. have a very dramatic episode coming up this Saturday, where the other co-host Kevin. I'm going to pit him up against his arch nemesis in the comedy scene. Ooh. Oh yes, who's, who's sort of? I don't know. I don't know. Are you leaving it a surprise? As who no, I'm not. I mean, uh, w- the episode would have been recorded by the time this goes out. But uh, I, I don't know. Um, <laughs> Nick Ford had some issues with some of the things we were saying about him on the last episode, so he uh, wanted to come on to clear the record. Um, oh, and I'm gotcha. worried. I'm worried things are going to get violent. Okay, so I'm Nick like, Ford? Nick yeah. Glade, I feel like he couldn't. I, yeah, I don't know what. I don't know what. What did they both say? seem so upset about? What? Was I on it? You weren't on it. Okay, good. Dun, Thank dun, God. Dun. Yeah. Comedy beef. <laughs> we need a, a comedy <laughs> update. Comedy <laughs> I, am, I might cut this part out depending on how the recording goes with the both of them hmm. because I don't want to, uh, you yeah, know, put sorry. gas in flames or whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sure. But they both Hopefully seemed pretty well. heated when both of them came to me and said that they wanted to do a podcast. And I was like, huh. 
What? That's gonna be interesting. I don't, I don't understand why that would be. I don't get it. But whatever. Well, they used to be best friends. Really. Uh, but I don't know what happened mm. that now has led to them. I don't know. To, it's Nick like they both they both have like thing. angry guy energy. Yeah. You know? A little bit. Yeah. yeah. I get that a lot. Yeah. Like some stuff happened in the past. <laughs> yeah. You know, in the somebody comedy. got molested yeah. or something. You know, there's <laughs> yeah. a lot of pent up something going right. on there. Yeah. yeah. I so, feel like I came into comedy at a weird time because I only started like two years ago. Yeah. And I feel like I came in kind of when a whole bunch of sort of drama happened mm, really maybe yeah. huh. I, don't know. I don't know i don't it know it feels either. that way it feels like a lot of like and i don't want to pry a lot of people does. in the scene don't know how to keep their genitals to themselves oh. it's like they got a hard time that with that thing? you know yeah, yeah. It's like, just keep it to yourself man yeah. it's okay you don't yeah. have to fuck another comedian you can there's plenty of other people <laughs> Yeah. You know? Wait, you don't have to? No, it's it's a crazy thing. There's plenty. You don't have to do it. Or, uh, <laughs> well, I think I would have to talk to you. Or <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. <clears throat> no, yeah, I don't know. It has. It is weird. I think that's just comedy scenes in general. Like yeah. people just start fucking, and then people have problems with each other. Yeah. 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 Well, the, yeah. the High school never ends. There's drugs and there's drinking, yeah. and people get go mad. insane. Yeah. Yeah. And yeah. the woke people have problems with like the racist people, and the racist people have problems. With I try to toe both lines, you yeah. know. Yeah. Try to be as fake as I can. Yeah. yeah. Be a woke Definitely. racist. <laughs> you don't want to be. You can't be predictable. Yeah. That's the worst thing that you can be as a comedian is being yeah, predictable. Definitely. Because if you're going up there and I know exactly what you're going to be saying. Yeah. Not even not not because I'll hear people say the same things, but just like embodying these same like things that you see in other comedians. Like sure. I'm the I'm the gay guy. I'm the I'm the black comedian. I'm the fat comedian or whatever. Yeah. And it's just. I'm it's not the gay comedian. Yeah, I'm not. I, I, I'm the fat the gay one. <laughs> it's rough being like, dude. There's like six fat white guy comedians, and I'm trying. I'm well, trying not. to climb that ladder, yep. dude. I'm yeah. trying to climb. Well, yeah. that, you always, that's no, you're better you than always have you're really better. good. And en- anytime I've seen you, I've always really appreciated the energy that you oh, have thanks, on the stage. Man. You always have really good energy, whether you're bombing or you, but you don't even really bomb that much. No, I never. I've never seen you do. I've never seen you do poorly. Really? No, you do good shit. I've never seen you do poorly. Guys, no. No, I'm sucking off. Right. You wow. missed out. You, you should hear it. Most of the time when you're good performing. Shit, yeah. So. yeah. I've never seen. Yeah, I've never seen you go up there and be like, "Oh fuck, this guy." Bombing is. Uh, it sucks so bad. It's fun though. On it. no, it's, it's great. funny. I kind of like it. Funny. It, it is I, funny. It makes the other. Like com- it makes the other comics laugh. For <laughs> yeah. Sure. It is funny. But it does yeah. suck bad when yeah. you bomb. It's not. It's a horrible. Because you can bomb, but you just as long as you're confident in what you're doing, still, then it's the best. I mean, I don't know. It's almost like though. It's almost like you you start to. It's not that. Like I think you start to learn how to not bomb. Yeah, you know what I mean, sure. Like you start mm-hmm. to learn how to, or at least like get through a bomb. Yeah, you know better, I mean? you know. I really bomb, like so. watching people I don't like bomb. It's like it. <laughs> it they don't know how to handle it. Like either. watch them get no laughs. And I'm just like, <laughs> Justice. Like a very prominent. Like I like to. I like to watch the like the big. You drop know, some names. The big yeah. comic. Drop no, some names. name drops. No, no, no name. Drop drops. If, I could, if I could think of I'll some names, I would name them. I, I love to see well-known, big, big Michigan comics mm. get up and... I think I know who you're talking about. Eat, eat, eat. I mean, it's it's funny. <laughs> I like I like seeing people that I know are funny bomb, because that just makes it even funnier. Because like I know that they're funny. It's yeah, just they're yeah, having yeah. a fucking weird moment. Right. I think I know who you're talking about. Who am I talking about? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I'll list some, I'm pe- not, I'm I'll list some not, people. I'm actually not talking about anybody specific because I've watched just, all those people bomb. You know what, you know what I, I mean? Yeah. So it's like... Yeah. I just like seeing anybody that's like getting booked on shows bomb, yeah. basically. Anybody that's getting booked on shows that I don't actually think is there's, very fucking funny and they're bombing. Like, this is... There's great. one lady. She comes to the Roadhouse, I think, every week and she just bombs every time. But I always see her getting booked for shows and I'm like, I'm con- what's she's, happening? She's probably like, a lesbian. I, I don't Where understand. Um, yeah. Yeah. Yes. It's tough. I, it hurts. Whenever she goes on stage, I'm like, I have to leave the room. <laughs> this, oh, no. this hurts. Like oh, one time, no. she one time she was bombing so bad, she got one chuckle, and then she pointed at that person and was like, thank you so much. And it's like, that's going to make people want to laugh less. You that's, can't point that yeah. out. <laughs> it's crazy. So much. Yeah. Comedy's yeah. wild, dude. Yeah. yeah. It's wild. I wrote it. Yeah. Oh, hell yeah, dude. yeah. That was cool. pretty dope. Fuck yeah. yeah. Uh, me cool. and Brian Omi. Shout out Brian Omi. Uh, I hope he comes back. He has done comedy in a while. It's okay. a while but... By the way, I'm going to cut out her name. Okay. Yeah, yeah. that's probably fair. Yeah. yeah. She gives very horny energy, though. Like, like corny, corny or horny? Horny mom horny, energy. Like horny, horny mom energy, yeah. dude. 
she a good looking broad yeah, or nah. pretty scary? She's like, like an older lady. Hard no. <laughs> yeah. no, no, no. <laughs> No, I think part of it is just the comedy castle people. Like, if you do the class, like you, you're gonna get booked a lot. Yeah, you'll get you're gonna. Time and stuff. Yeah, it's yeah. What is? No. When did fucking comedy become si- college? Where you have to yeah, have a it seems, it seems <laughs> silly. Yeah, it I don't is know. silly. It doesn't seem. I mean, silly. it's just it they're like they're comfortable. Like you know, you're not gonna offend anybody when you book. Like, sure. like you're not like, you know, it's a safe bet for yeah. sure. Yeah, yeah. She yeah. wants. She wants asked me and kevin if we wanted to get an airbnb together to like go do the show in like caseville or some shit i was like do you guys want to double team me nah it? yeah i was like no i'm good man don't you, also don't you have a husband right yeah yeah where he's into this polyamorous thing so it's, okay it's like, cool. i like little white boys in puerto rico yeah, well, i like little <laughs> boys yeah. all right enough of that come on <laughs> chill on her she's nice she's nice lady <laughs> She's nice I don't. She's, 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 she's very nice. She's very nice lady. She's also not gonna watch. She's never gonna watch. I've yeah. got no so stake in this. Care, she'll watch it. <laughs> <laughs> you should actually make a clip specifically for her, yeah. and then we and can all we can all send it yeah. to her. I'll follow her and I'll send it. Like we yeah. talked and about. Well, you don't know Gabe, me. Drop some more names. <laughs> oh. no, I get in so much trouble. I do I this know, every right? time. Yeah. People get so mad. Okay. Yeah. You like really know people in the scene, so you really can't say that. Whereas I am a fucking hermit, and I show up and I just like say the n word. Yeah. yeah, I That's think true. I said every slur on my set on Monday. I think I hit every single. Hell one, yeah, honestly. dude! Did dude, you I um? Do that. Yeah. Did you get? I I heard that. I I don't remember if it was you specifically, but I heard you got like kicked, like you got kicked from <laughs> like, apothecary coffee, was, right, or something. Oh, 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 like you got banned. Shout out apothecary. <laughs> I've never been there, oh, and you were the one who great. told me about it too. And go. then a couple a weeks mic. later, it's, it's still a good mic, and you guys should definitely. It's fun. Go, actually. It's fun. Yeah. yeah, I've never done well there, okay. but it's fun. Yeah, it's just, a cute place. Yeah. yeah, I just said drone strike, pedophile. I just said way too many. I because I, I you know said, the keyword. I said yeah, yeah, too yeah. many, and it was just bad. I think it was it was and trans the trans thing. There was a trans barista walking. It was a whole fucking. Dude, I, oh, last man. time I was there, I made that trans barista laugh with the I have, I do good. I, I do like, a good time. So maybe nice. it wasn't that. I think it might have been the Palestinian like drone striking uh, children's yeah. in Iran thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because yeah. there were women with the yeah, job. The girls. God, fucking. The girls who go there. These, these fucking snowflakes. I'm, I mean, <laughs> Jesus. I'm just, I'm just trying to get an espresso. Mar- <laughs> <laughs> like, I'm, uh, <laughs> I'm trying to get a like matcha. People just walking in to get coffee, get a and they're black like, black coffee." <laughs> <laughs> it's like I mean, I'm in Arizona with my uh, working for a government agency. I'm drone striking kids and jacking off. And I'm just trying to get my matcha and this racist Asian Trump supporter gay guy. I'm so I was. I mean, I was stressed like this. So I, that I mean, that adds to it. It as hits because well, yeah. like people and also like. I can't tell if I can be mad at you or like you what's yeah, going on. Like, yeah. are you? That's the thing. You can't. <laughs> exactly. Because Cult- like cultural technically, ambi- I mean, you're a minority, but you're all in many ways. Yeah. Cultural ambiguity. Yeah. Right. yeah. <laughs> I mean, and that, and that's a, that's a very powerful part of yeah, like yeah. my comedy yeah. ethos or whatever. Yeah, yeah. That's why I can't get away with. You yeah. know, most Chaldeans can get away with saying the end word, saying you know offensive yeah. shit. But I look too Jewy to do it. So I... Just fucking no. Let it fly, man. God. Don't do it. Don't do it. No. <laughs> don't do it. Don't do it. Hey, you hopped on this podcast. I don't want to be, be on the last episode <laughs> yeah. of P Boys. Uh, <laughs> uh, I don't we're think you ever the Red P Boys. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Patriot Boys. You know what I'm <laughs> uh, yeah. This is totally turning into a Red Pill podcast. Turning to Infowars. <laughs> now, now we just need to get OnlyFans models yeah. and just and just them. yell at them. Yeah. We just yeah. need to fucking yell at them and call. And them talk about how I have a wife and yeah. you guys are shameful or. Uh, yeah. Yeah. We should get. Uh, Jesus, we should get. get uh, what's his name? <laughs> Who's the bald dude? Uh, Andrew Tate? Yes. Andrew yes. Tate. Let's get Andrew I think Tate I've on. tried. Let's get Andrew Tate on. Let's get Jordan Peterson. Yes. Dude, apparently Candace Owens has been like covering for Andrew Tate as far as like their trafficking and stuff. Yeah, Can- yeah, Candace Owens that. got married to like some. She's the weirdest bitch ever, bro. Yeah. I swear. Because she was at Daily Wire for a little bit. Now she's like doing her own thing. And she's like basically just like covering for like pedophiles now. Essentially. All right. She's like yeah. mouthpiece. Yeah. All right, Fun. Candace. She's my least favorite, favorite white woman. Yeah. For sure. <laughs> <laughs> so true. Like, god. no. Uh, Gabe, if you stuck with black girls, you would have ended up with a Candace. Oh my god, that would have sucked. <laughs> Jeez. Yeah. The that'd worst be, kind of a black be, woman. That'd be god. Like, the white one. They're finally landing a black girl, and it's, it's Candace hard Owens. Right, yeah, yeah, it's a hard right it's conservative. Because you know she doesn't twerk or have fun or like drink <laughs> Hennessy or anything like that. Or, or know how to fun dance. Black people. You know, there's no way. Yeah. She's any fun. She's dude. like a ballet black lady. <laughs> yeah. yeah. That's what right. it is. Yeah. She goes to the opera or some shit. Ugh. 
Oh, God. She's not going to Nicki Minaj. Right. Whatever. Yeah, because if she's defending pedophiles, she's definitely going to, like, eyes wide shut, weird fucking yeah. shit. Apparently, so her, her husband is, like, British royalty. They're, like, a lord or something. And apparently, uh, he's, like, a closeted gay guy. And then nice. their their um, their yeah. meeting was very brief. Makes and sense it was, like, that she's, very he's arranged. with a yeah. perfect, uh, perfect beard. You want a black beard, not a blonde beard. How yeah. about that? What's the chick from Colorado? The the representative from Colorado? Who, I have no idea. Uh, Lauren Boebert. Lauren Boebert. Mm, she's, she's hot. A, she's a dime, dude. Dude. And she gives she used she to gives be handies at fucking dude. place. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like fucking sick date. That's kind of sick date. Not gonna lie. Holy shit. OPHJ is on the yeah. first date. She's so oh, crazy. Gosh. That yeah. sex is good. Just you know it's good. Where do you think he came? <laughs> yeah. I, I think about this. But where do you think he came? Did you just like mm. maybe she you like, think she let him in? Maybe she well, like was a hand job. Like maybe she oh. leaned over at the end and then I don't like, know if they got to out. finish. I think they That's got interrupted. Oh, okay. Yeah, Good but she day. was like vaping and shit in the theater. It was cool. Yeah, she doesn't give a fuck, dude. Yeah. Yeah. She's awesome. like, I'm giving this guy general. handy. I'm vaping. Yeah, I mean, Christ, these are I'm the fucking representative. Yeah, guys. I'm the rep- I'm in the house representative. Did they do the popcorn thing where he like cut a hole in the popcorn bucket? And then... <laughs> Use the butter as tactful. She was just like. Give me no, that thing. Just pull just the dick out. mashing like, it like dough. Yeah, it was like through the pants. Yeah. Like, she was making oh, it was through the out. pants? It was OP. It was OP yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Damn. So he would have just came in his pants. Yeah, in his undies. Yeah, sure. that's kind of gross. Like a real man. Yeah, yeah. then it solidifies, <laughs> and then you have to peel your dick off. I yeah. thought I came in my pants earlier today. Earlier today? Not today. <laughs> actually, the other day. I had a really I had a really crazy wet dream, and I just woke oh, up okay. like, oh. oh. No, that happens to everyone from time but to time. But I didn't actually bust, guys. I... I, I didn't bust. Thanks for clarifying. Yeah. Celebrate right now. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Just in the dream. Just in the dream. I was right. having sex with a porn star. She had a shaved head. It was. It was you know which one? Oh, Christy Mac. I think I don't know. BML color. Blonde shaved head. I just saw the mm. like the back of her. You body. can't be blonde and shaved head. Hey, yeah. Yeah. Oh, I know exactly what you're talking. Yeah. About. Oh, I don't know okay. who it was. <laughs> Jacob did the research. <laughs> Uh, it was cool to research of dream. <laughs> I don't like to know their names. Because yeah. <laughs> it makes yeah. me sad. <laughs> I don't want to see names or faces. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> they have fathers. Those women had fathers. Yeah. So, anyways, who else does Kevin want to fuck at the comedy castle? <laughs> no, he gets. I'm not doing this again. Wait, wait, he got what? so mad at me. Are a lot fuck of- you. No, this, <laughs> we can get mad at you. I'm not saying enough. Are a lot of the coworkers there? Are they pretty attractive women working there? Yeah, there's, there's, a there's. Yeah, yeah. That's good. Yeah. Got the hot nice ladies. There. Nice yeah, ladies the there at the ladies. castle. Are they? Are, do they do comedy themselves, or are they just waitressing? No, they're there? just waitressing. Good. It's it's decent That's money. Good. Thank God. <laughs> They gotta be, you know, the That's one kill high, Tony um, uh, waitress who always comes out with yeah. her tits out. Oh my god! Yeah, nice. I'm like, dude. Oh, what's yeah? What's, what's her, her name? name? She should do a oh, set. I think it's like Haley or Heidi. Like, Heidi. Heidi. Yeah. Heidi. Yeah. That's it. It's Heidi. <laughs> I, yeah, I didn't. I didn't know that this whole time and pretend not. He said Haley. He's, he's like, yeah. it's it's. A, he's like, actually, actually this is her Instagram. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. She's uh. She's too hot. It's too hot. She's an attractive. That's too woman. hot. Yeah, yeah. I don't know. It is pretty weird to like when they parade her around because I'm just like, this feels like a 2006 move. Like we're in 2024, and I don't, you guys are having a chick with her tits come out in the middle of your fucking yeah. comedy show. It's awesome though. It's it is pretty. Awesome. I think it's yeah. fine. I think there was a so long time where that stuff brand, was like really looked yeah. down upon, but yeah. we're now we're in like an era where like a little a nice sexual appeal is very nice to see. Yeah. That's yeah. Nice. and I'm sure she's she likes just, it. Yeah, I'm sure she. Yeah, I mean she keeps doing it. Obviously, she's a dumb bitch. <laughs> With, and we yeah. should get her on the podcast and call her a whore. Right, yeah. we gotta call her a whore. She's not a feeding a child yeah. with those tits. And she gets to blow Tony Hinchcliffe. Yeah, like yeah. every week. Wait, I, thought they, I thought he was a gay guy. Yeah. Is he? Is he a gay I don't guy? know. He's like gay how I'm gay, I guess. Yeah, 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 yeah. He's, he's, exactly. he's got yeah. gay energy. Yeah. yeah, you were talking about too lazy to try earlier. Mm-hmm. I think it's fascinating all these YouTubers who started a career of just like making videos, talking shit about like famous comedian podcasters. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Like there's so many of them. Yeah, too lazy is the best. So he's one of the he's goaded though. I, d- I don't watch any of them anymore because oh, I'm really? just like I don't give a fuck about like what you think about Burt. Cre- he's fucking annoying. Like yeah. whatever. I don't need to watch. It's like, a lot of hate. It's a lot of haters. Like, yeah, I do like. I just I guess it I enjoy is. a nice hate session. I think yeah. that's what yeah. it is. I do too. I, I just need a hate session. Yeah, I watched a little Red Bar earlier today. Love a good little Red yeah. Bar session. You guys watch Red yeah. Bar? Yeah, What's Red Bar. Mm. He's like um he used to be part of uh I don't know the bigger coalition, maybe part of the Kumia's like network, but he like branched off, but he's got his own um website and network, okay. but he just does heavy critiquing on comedy people. Uh. But he'll occasionally like send um 
his fans are like so loyal they'll go get people to go to shows and infiltrate and like record and they'll be like red bars watching shit like that okay. but i mean he just like heavily is into like he'll like shit on everybody like Fun. i think i watched something on ryan long today he went in on him because he had a really bad kill tony um, i can't wait for him to go on, on this podcast <laughs> i can't wait till those <laughs> podcast review channels Start talking shit about the P boys. Make sure you tag Red right. Right. Yeah, that's, a good, that's actually a good bar to set, man. Yeah, get in there and start, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Have them start talking shit about the P boys. <laughs> yeah, I like it. Fuck yeah. Uh-huh. <laughs> there was a. I don't know if it was the same guy. I don't remember some YouTube video, but he was talking shit about the um, the comedy mothership. Sure. And there was one detail that I was like, was so fucking like funny. He was like. Because Joe Rogan apparently put like uh like he has a wall of all like the greatest like comedy albums, yeah. but he put his own up on the wall, Oof. his 2016 one in between in between I believe um uh oh man just like two really famous uh, Robin Bring Williams and I think uh, who was the other guy Richard Pryor sure. like in between those guys he's in between them on his yeah wall. I'm like that's so. That's fucking <laughs> egotistical, dude. Yeah. Like, what are you doing? Can we go in on Joe yeah. Rogan for like ten minutes, real quick? <laughs> sure, sure. Yeah. Right as well. That's we the big boys for making yeah. enemies. Just the just that he's kind of become the the arbiter of what's funny. That word arbiter has been used by many people. People mm-hmm. said this about him like many times. Yeah. I mean, it's really just nauseating. I think he yeah. just put out a new special and it didn't really get good reviews. Like it's it was being all right. It's being likened you know. to like Brendan Schaub's um, special. Really? He put really? his out. Yeah. How bad? Like how atrociously bad? I didn't mind it. I know a lot of people hated it, but I didn't mind it. Yeah, it was okay. I hated Brendan Schaub's special. <laughs> really? <laughs> oh, at least, at least at least at least Joe Rogan is like an actual seasoned comic. Sure. Doing yeah. it forever. Yeah. You know? But I think Schaub's gotten to a point where he realized that he was in a position that. That he knew he wasn't supposed to be in. Mm-hmm. There's been a lot. You can see growth in Shab if you like listen to like recent stuff now. Not that I'm like listening. To <laughs> him, it, him and, and Chris. Uh, yeah. The Ilya. Chris <laughs> Ilya. Are, oh yeah, he's his co-host right now, isn't he? Yeah. Fuck, dude. It's fucking crazy. Fuck. Didn't he have a sex cult? Wasn't Chris, Chris Ilya have like a? I don't. I heard something. I don't think it was ever that deep. No. I think they tur- I think they blew up whatever happened to Chris Ilya. Really? I think. Yeah. I think I don't know. I think whatever. he was doing nefariously yeah, like know. gross things, but I think the whole idea of a sex cult is absurd. I think he was probably messaging a lot of like seventeen year olds or whatever. That's not cool at all. That's, yeah, 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 that's but that's yeah. not a sex cult. But they I'm blew saying. that shit out of the water. You know? <laughs> I mean, what's wrong with that? It's creepy. Seventeen like, <laughs> once a year. Jerry <laughs> Seinfeld did it. Not very long. <laughs> yeah, Jerry hey, Seinfeld, Seinfeld did do it. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Shout out Jerry Seinfeld. Shout out Shoshana. Yeah, I don't keep up with the comedy drama or the. I don't really care. I just care about like comedy and also there's enough drama in the local comedy scene. Yeah, right? right. It's true. We've got it. enough of our Dude, there's enough drama in the local comedy. We could there could be See, a whole just show of us that too. Yeah. 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 Comedy yeah. beef. We could make a podcast called Comedy Beefs. Yeah. And it would be just also, every I week. don't think it's good to like think about like other people like that. Yeah, for, it's true. Yeah. It's not. It's not yeah. good. But I fucking hate Kill Tony. I, mean, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, I like Kill Tony. I, I do mean, you like it. I watch it occasionally. It's hit or miss. No, I, 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 I sometimes I it used sucks. to like it. Yeah, yeah well, sometimes it's not good. Well, like yeah. if maybe like you, I went through like um, I started like Matt and Shane's, and then I went yeah. to KT, and then I'm like I'm at like Lemon Party and like Tim Dillon right now, and like uh, I'm like yeah. comfortably I'm, like this is a. Tim Dillon is great, nice. dude. I'm sorry, like from the beginning of like the YouTube archive, I'm just like working my way up. Right okay, now. So it's beautiful. Yeah. So I'm like oh, going yeah. through like the COVID. So like it's really, oh really, it's fun. okay. It's a fun little uh, yeah. time capsule. Here's what's crazy too. I somebody lumped in. Um, there was a discussion between some comics, mm-hmm. and they were talking about Kill Tony, and I brought up Kill Tony, and they said something about like about how that's all part of the Rogan verse. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. Right? it is. And I heard that term Rogan verse, mm-hmm. and it, that kind of. That kind of I was like, well, okay, yeah, I guess, but also Tony Hinchcliffe was doing Kill Tony, yeah, way, way before, way before, mm-hmm. way before. Yeah, I don't know if Co- Joe Rogan. Yeah, I mean Joe Rogan was doing his podcast too, but yeah, Joe Rogan blew up when he. Uh, Joe Rogan blew up when the tape came out of him roasting Carlos Mencia. Yeah, that's when he. Yeah. That's when he popped. Yeah, was the whole Carlo him calling out Carlos Mencia for yeah. stealing jokes. Yeah. Which I really, really wanted to do the other, the other a couple of weeks ago. Steal a joke. There was some com- There was some guy who took like the Mark Ridley's class who was like performing for like the one hundred and one like showcase or whatever. Uh-huh. And I know, I know for a fact this dude has seen me do this specific bit where I talk about my pink dick and I compare it to a cartoon character. And he did it the he 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 talked about his pink. He talked about black girls' pink dick and then compared it to a cartoon character. Ooh. And I was like, bro. 
for real. Like, and I know, oh, cool. I know that he's seen me do that bit multiple times. Who, who is it? Uh, he's like some newer guy. Um, uh, Come back. I next had his, his name. <laughs> yeah, I have to yeah. get his name. I had his name. I forgot it because okay. it was a couple Has weeks he ago. Been in the scene a while, or is he just a new he guy from the been, class? Yeah. He's he's been in the scene. Uh, I think he's been in the scene longer than me, but I don't think he does that many mics. Like okay. I feel like I've done more mics than him at okay. this point. Um, but yeah, that happens, man. Yeah, it's rampant. Actually, yeah. I've seen it happen a lot. So fucking annoying. I was so pissed, dude. I was like, I was like, I, I was working too because I was working, and I looked around oh and I was God. like, that's my bit. Like to the people like around me, I was like, that's my like, bit. By the it, way, it wasn't. It wasn't like adjacent to your bit. It was like your... it was just if you wrote out the beats of the yeah. bit, it was just exactly the same. He said a different cartoon yeah. character, but it was like sure. just the same. Fuck. It's like, bro. He, yeah. It just, it was more of like I guess a concept steel which is yeah. like annoying yeah uh, it's not that original of a concept but whatever yeah. i guess uh, but if you noticed it enough you're like yeah. well that's hey, frustrating we're gonna call your boys yeah i'll, I'll yeah. call mine call yeah. the irish mafia i'll call the yeah i'll call electric yeah, call call yeah. Call yeah. 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 We're gonna fuck him up. <laughs> yeah. yeah well you think of his name say it and then we'll and then yeah. we'll clip just that part yeah yeah, yeah. do what do do i know him mm. You might, you maybe have seen him. He he goes to the mics, you know, every now okay. and then. I don't see him a lot. I actually haven't seen him since that happened. Oh. So he doesn't, mm. see, he clearly doesn't go yeah, he, up that he much. He killed with your bit and then he just dipped that. Dude, <laughs> dude was bombing until he did that bit. Oh my God. At least give you like $20 <laughs> or something. Right? At least yeah. buy the joke. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Buy, exactly. Yeah. But the thing is, is like, I kind of cooled down off of it too because I feel like he was bombing and then he started riffing and then I don't know if he necessarily did it on purpose but he did it you know yeah. I think he was just kind of just you know going off the top of his head but whatever I get worried about like if I am stealing someone's bit sometimes because yeah, like I'll, I'll like yeah. Yeah. I'll make a joke and then I'll be like that sounds like way too like like someone had to have done this joke before yeah mm-hmm. yeah, there's yeah. Some, yeah same with me like yeah. I'll, write, I'll write shit down and yeah. i'll be like this somebody's <laughs> somebody's thought of this you yeah know what I mean? like this mm-hmm. has got to be somebody's joke yeah yeah but no one said anything yet so i'm gonna keep doing all my jokes yeah, until. maybe you're just a genuine comedian dude, who makes so writes original, really good dude. Jokes. dude i'm just really good at telling <laughs> jokes i don't think i've ever bombed <laughs> you've never <laughs> once bombed yeah wow. i bombed in front of paul Ely. if i bomb it's for <laughs> <a ball. laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh. He did a whole thing about how he was like trans Chaldean because he like he identifies as a Syrian, and then I went up and I was like, "Yeah, I'm also a trans Chaldean, but I identify as Jewish because I think it will make me better at comedy." <laughs> I like that. Fuck, it just yeah. fucking bombed. It really? Just, oh, no right. one laughed. I like that. Yeah. What was it at? Was it at New Way? It was at New Way. Oh, well. well yeah, yeah. I mean, that doesn't count, then, yeah. man. That doesn't count. Bombing in New Way doesn't count. <laughs> yeah. It's not yeah. a bomb. It, doesn't, it really doesn't. It doesn't go on your record. It doesn't yeah. go on your yeah. permanent record. Yeah. Bombing yeah. <laughs> at Roadhouse, though, that's a yeah, fucking. That's a, yeah, that, that's don't, a. Don't ever bomb a Roadhouse. That's a yeah. career ender, ever. brother. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, uh, Andy, do you have anything you want to shout out on the people? The number one Metro Detroit comedy podcast. Uh, the number one Metro Detroit comedy, comedy podcast. This one? This one. Okay, uh, cool. <laughs> it's <laughs> so name specific. A, name it's a just... better one. <laughs> name a better one. <laughs> the number one Detroit comedy podcast in a in an office building in Southfield? Yeah, yep. Southfield, yeah. Okay. yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Name another one. Area code, <laughs> this area. No one's giving me a Zip code, one. zip code, yeah. I mean, tru- truly. Truly. Um, <laughs> uh, you, you can check me out at the Roadhouse Fuck yeah. every other Wednesday. I run a pretty fun open mic there. Yeah, it's yeah. a shitty little dive bar. Yep. Um, cheap drinks, sure. cheap Hell food, yeah. and the food's great. Mm-hmm. Come through. We have a blast. We yep. just stick around. There's nothing serious. Show up, go up. Yep. Um, yeah. Come check it out. Uh, let's see. I have. Do I have any shows? I, I don't think I have any shows coming up. Actually, that's depressing. It. Yeah, it's depressing. That sucks. Know. Let me check my calendar real quick. You can cut this. All out, right. right, Jacob. Yeah, Jacob can talk about um, himself. Check out the the Inner Wizard YouTube channel. There, we're slowly posting podcasts on there. If you like my voice, for some reason, it's pretty it's pretty brutal, but it, it'll get better. <laughs> yeah um right. hopefully start seeing more of me but i tend to do this thing where i like turn to a hermit for a couple of weeks and yeah, emerge again but i'd like to come on this podcast more yeah. often. i'm a p-boy i'd yeah. love to be a p-boy oh, yeah. it's a lot of fun i had a, I some good energy you could be a p-boy yeah. you're a p-boy now yeah. Yeah. Gabe, hey everybody do you have anything oh well um you were on 
David Tell's. I was on David Tell's Instagram. I have right. to say that every oh, time. Yeah. <laughs> what? Yeah. yeah. Yep. I'm My a, hero, David Tell's. Yeah. You're on me. Oh, yeah. What? Yeah, because he was he did a weekend at the the castle, and then he took a photo yeah. with the staff, and I was like right next to him. It was pretty cool. He shook mm-hmm. my hand, dude. That's awesome. And then I tried it. I was like, Charlie, hey, yo, my p- dick is pink. As we were, because we all took yeah. a we all took a picture on the stage, so like the microphone was right there. And he was like, Yeah, oh, fuck, dude. <laughs> that's yeah, but also you know the show that you just you just got the room yeah. you just got booked, man. You yeah. wanna talk about that? Yeah. So okay, yeah. it was gonna be. Doing ten minutes, yeah, at the North End Tap Room, yep, in Royal Oak, September eighteenth. Hell yeah, Wednesday. Yeah, Wednesday. It's also an open mic. Yeah, Yeah, it's also an open mic. Um, Yeah, that's gonna be the time. Even though, uh, even though the president of Detroit Comedy told me I should push the time back, but we'll figure that out. There's a president of Detroit. (laughs) He left a comment, and he was he was telling me that. No, he said that I should push it back to 8 to 10 because Ridley's mic is going on at the same time. Oh, yeah. But I think uh, people, it's right down the street from Ridley's. If you, you know, if you want to walk, just, yeah. it's walking distance from Ridley's. But also, is is it, so how's the, what's the setup? Is it going to be like open mic and then. So like, it's going to be me open yeah. and then have like two or three open micers yeah. and then you doing okay. 10 minutes and then like three Couple open micers more, and then. And then Blaine, Blaine do like 15, 15 minutes, yeah. and then just open micers open for micro. the rest of the night. Well, then it gets Blaine, start- Drews. Yeah. Blaine Drews. Blaine Drews. Shout out Blaine Drews. Mm-hmm. Or, um, Blaine dude. Uh, yeah. Is it Blaine? It is Blaine. Blaine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know why I... Yeah. You, there's a Blaine There's a Blaine Hill. I was like, wait. Yeah, right. not, talking about the, yeah no, But Blaine, Blaine, yeah. Blaine Drews, yeah, he's yeah. cool. Mm-hmm. Dude, again, yeah. I feel like it worked, me and his... Because we're both... We're all young boys. So we're young sure. boys. Works yeah, it's well. the good boys of comedy. The good boys of comedy. Yeah. That's what it's going to be called. Yeah. But yeah, if it goes, people. I want people to come out because if, then we can make a monthly show, yeah. and I can book more people. Fuck I'll yeah. book these guys. Oh, yeah. I'll book other people. And will be there. Yeah. Yeah. Be there. there Jacob well. will probably be there. Yeah. Um, um, I'm doing Detroit to LA September 10th. Look also. at that. Yes. Nice. My whole my whole family's gonna be there. It's yeah. gonna suck, but you know, I need those votes. So vote whatever. for Gabe. It's like American <laughs> like Idol. Vote in person. It's not like a clap meter. Uh, yeah, a yeah, yeah. Clap meter would be <laughs> crazy. <laughs> no, it's a, it's like a piece of paper. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I do want to try and go yeah, to that one, and then comedy, yeah. I think Ken Woods is supposed yeah. to be doing his as well. I want to show up and just act like a, a, I think a maniac. At, his on a different Ken's day. In, Ken's is in November. Um, I it, yeah, he he sent me the date, but mm, I think it's probably yeah. a different days. Whatever. Can I tell you guys a super funny story about when I did the Detroit to LA competition? Yeah. All right. So, like you said, you do the Detroit to LA. You invite you invite your family, you yeah, invite right. friends. Yeah, because you need those votes, dude. You need Fuck, those votes. Yeah. You need those votes. Or am I you? You're probably not going to win the judges. <laughs> you know yeah. what I'm saying? Like, that's yeah. in my head. I'm yeah. not going to win the judges' votes. So, I'm going to stack the audience, yeah. right? I'm yeah. It brings people up. So, I had some people come out to the show. My friend, a longtime friend of mine from high school, uh-huh. came with his girlfriend and his, I, I know his, I've known his girlfriend for years too. But, okay. um, they come to the show, right? I had, I thought I had a really good set. I had mm-hmm. a strong set. Um, one of the best I've ever done. The crowd loved me. I was like, oh, this, you know, I'm yeah. super pumped. Um, so the show ends, and I didn't get, I didn't, I didn't win either. I didn't sure. win the judges or, or the votes. And who I'm did like, win? All right, well, whatever. Um, oh, who did win? Judges' vote was Scott's Veland. Mm. Oh, oh, this was the Ken Wood one. Yes, and Ken yeah. Wood. Mm-hmm. Ken Wood was the was the audience vote. I think. Yeah, mm. and Scott's. It, and shout out to both of them. They both had phenomenal sets. Also, like you know, what I'm saying. But you know, I was like, oh, whatever. So I go out. You know, you go out of Ridley's. Yeah. And I was meeting with the people that came to see me, and my buddy's girlfriend runs up to me, and she goes, uh, "Hey, Andy." That was really great. Um, I'm sorry, but I couldn't in my heart uh, vote for you. Damn. She's like, you were really funny, but in my heart, I just had to vote for the uh, the other guy. Oh, my God. I was like, you didn't have to say that. <laughs> and I was like, okay, so I'm not crazy, right? Mm-hmm. Okay, so yeah. I'm, like, I'm like, okay. I'm like, all right, I thought she was fucking with me. You know, yeah. I thought she was screwing my head. So I'm like... Oh, I'm like, oh no, that's okay. You know, that's fine. Uh, I found out backstage I only lost by one vote. Uh huh. And she has a meltdown. Like she's like, oh, and I'm like, 
at this point, I'm just realizing, like, oh, she's serious. Like, she actually didn't vote for me. <laughs> That's <laughs> right? crazy. And so in my brain, I'm like, so literally, I went home that night, and I got almost no sleep. Like, it fucked <laughs> like, oh, my head so damn. much. Dude. And I'm like, did she really not vote for me? Like, I couldn't figure out. I couldn't put two and two together. So I, ca- I tell my wife. I'm like, I'm like, I told my wife the whole situation. I'm like, is that not the weirdest thing? She's like, well, I'm going to call her. I'm like, no, don't call her. I'm like, it's fine. Almost no sleep. I wake up the next day and I get a text message. And it's from, oh. it's from this girl. Damn. So I call my, I'm, I'm like, I get this text message. I call my wife. I'm like, are you kidding? Like, did you call her? She's like, no, I didn't. So she sends me this text message. And this is word for word. Good morning, Andy. I have to apologize for our convo last night after the show. I didn't mean to offend you or anything by not voting for you and then telling you I didn't. Damn. It was a really hard decision between my top three. Top three. Which you were in. You were in. Get top two. You were in. And I had to go with my gut. I wasn't, I was top, I wasn't even second. Yeah. This is the weirdest person ever. What the f- <laughs> Right? It, it's not like. What the f- it's not like she's in the comedy scene, right? She doesn't know those other guys. She was just judging on merit. Hey, yeah. you know what? <laughs> I guess. I mean, that's we- If you're going to do that, fine. And this is don't why, tell this you. This is why women shouldn't vote. No, that's, why. <laughs> <laughs> that's why. That's why. No. No, but that's so, isn't that so crazy? Yeah, she shouldn't have told you. That's screwed with my head, dude. I'm yeah. like, she should not have told you. That it's was kind crazy. Of funny, that it's just yeah. crazy. It's crazy you told me. Yeah. Like, it's fine that you just, did. Like, I don't care. Whatever. You, yeah. Okay, I get it. Or at least make a joke about it. Don't, like... Right. No, but nah, she was, I like, wouldn't, straight yeah. up, yeah. came uh, right up to me, too. Like, after yeah. the show, like, made a point. It's a weird... That's a weird lady. Yeah. Jeez. I'm going to vote for Gabe only because I publicly said that I would vote for Gabe. <laughs> okay, so thanks. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. I, I don't know how you're I got your vote. I might just show up at the end and grab a paper. <laughs> okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Perfect, perfect. There you go. Yeah. yeah. Did she vote for Ken? I, I didn't even ask who no. she voted for. I didn't even care. I was just like, I... It's funny. You, you, I wonder. I wonder if you were third in the top yeah. in the top three. I, yeah, I was. Yeah, I was third. Yeah, yeah. Which I mean, I mean, well, right? Yeah, I mean, I had to have been in third. All honesty, yeah. You were third because uh, yeah, yeah. she was really. You were only up there because she knows you. Yeah. yeah. Oh no. Yeah, it's so funny. It's crazy. That's, she should have just voted for you just because. Yeah, right. Who like, cares? That's, that's the yeah. unspoken, you know what I'm that's saying? That's the rule of the it's Detroit to like, LA show. That's kind of the deal. Like, yeah. we all know. I yeah. didn't think I had to spell it out. You yeah. know what I'm saying? But yeah. it's like, come to the show. There's a voting thing. You know what yeah. I mean? Wink, wink, nudge, yeah. nudge. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Yeah. But yeah. but also, <laughs> also don't doesn't each person get two votes or no? Is it just one? No, I think each person gets one vote. I don't know. I, I actually I don't know. Yeah. I think it's because yeah. I work there and I don't even know. <laughs> yeah, no, I think it's because the judges vote is yeah. like secret, right? Yeah, it's yeah. Like whoever, yeah, whoever is the judge. Whoever the judge. Who's the judge? The judge yeah, we don't know. Okay. Probably Bill Bill booked me for it, so maybe he's the judge. I don't. Probably know. Bill's one of them. I would yeah. Think. I don't know. So maybe I think there's it's like kind a panel. Of yeah. yeah. Um, but no, I like. It was just a wild. Yeah. It's a wild thing. Yeah. Like I can't believe that she would say that to me. <laughs> yeah. It's crazy. She punched her in her fucking face. <laughs> Isn't that wild? Like, yeah. Oh. Just keep that shit to yourself, man. What the? Yeah. Fuck is yeah, right. Why would you? That's like a real me? school teacher thing. You you do. you realize this is my dream that you just took a piss all over. Yeah. Like what the fuck are you? Like I could have right? gone it's to L.A. Bad. Yeah. It's not <laughs> bad enough that I lost the competition. <laughs> I lost by but one. I lost by one. Then I. Did you actually lose by one? No. Oh, okay. No, I, I just said yeah. that. Like, I said yeah. that because I thought she was, when she first said it to me, I thought she was just screwing with me. You oh. know what I mean? Like, I didn't think she was serious. Yeah. So yeah, I was like, oh, yeah. As you would. I was like, oh, yeah, I only lost by one vote. You know, like, just being dumb. You were in jokester mode, Phil. You were in jokester mode. <laughs> yeah, I was in jokester mode. Yeah. yeah. And, she, and then she, like, she seriously was, like, super upset that yeah, I said that. Crazy. She thought I was serious. <laughs> Lady, and then it twisted my brain around yeah. for literally a day. I slept yeah. two hours that night, yeah. thinking I'm like, "There's no, she didn't vote." Like what? I did the uh, the like the funniest comedian in Windsor competition a few weeks ago, and then I I, I only did like WNBA jokes, and they didn't get any of them. And uh, I was just like, "Fuck, dude, yeah, <laughs> can't do that, dude." Yeah, I, I was tough because I drove up with Garrett, 
and I was telling Garrett, like, dude, I don't think they're going to, like, I'm going to do the WNBA shit. I don't think they're going to get it. And he's like, no, they watch basketball in Canada. And I was like, yeah, I guess so. Especially oh, the WNBA. <laughs> they watch the WNBA here. Yeah. <laughs> That's a crazy choice, Joseph. They... Yeah. <laughs> I'm not for sure. I don't. A wild choice. They, they knew about Brittany Caitlin Griner. Clark is I thought people right knew now. about Brittany Griner. They didn't yeah. know who that was. You need more yeah. hockey material. Yeah, you need more, you need more stuff, hockey, yeah. more Tim Hortons material, yeah. bro. Yeah. He was apparently hot, I guess, Tim Horton. Anyways, so. Uh, <laughs> Those guys make it. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what else we. He was apparently hot. Apparently, yeah. allegedly. Yeah. Bring that shit up, Jamie. Let's pull yeah. it up. Look, Jamie, young, look up, Tim look up, young Tim Horton. Tim Horton. Tim Horton. Young Tim Dick. Horton. Young Tim. I'm, uh, this is gonna take me. I'm gonna be. I'm gonna get put on a list. <laughs> You're gonna get some some very specific ads young now. Boys. So yeah, check out the the good boys of comedy. Is that what it's called? Yeah, the the good boys of comedy. Yeah, good boys of comedy. Yeah. yeah. And then yeah. It, yeah, if it goes well, we'll keep going. Is he a fucking dime piece, dude? dude what the is he what are we talking about? Dime. <clears throat> no way. That's <laughs> God damn. He's a sex machine. Dude, that's like the fifties right. too. Yep. Being jacked in he the fifties looks... was like you would you looked at it like a freak. Yeah, I know. Yeah, that's, yeah. that's insane. The other thing is the the second episode of Seventies Cops is coming out this Friday. Check it out. Check out that picture of hot it, Tim Horton. Yeah, put it. Yeah, put it. Show put it over Gabe. Hot Tim Horton. Yeah. Young Tim Horton. Damn, sex machine. <laughs> Um, yeah, seventies cops episode two comes out on Friday. Uh, watch it and like it. It's a funny series. Yeah, I think you, none oh, of yeah. you guys probably have any idea what nope. we're talking about. But nope. I saw check the, it out. I saw the ad. I saw yeah. the post. All right, cool. All right, that's it for this week of the P Boys. We'll see you next time. Big peace. <laughs>